I joined the Harmony program to experience how you can get back to your community and um, meet new people. I joined Harmony because I have a couple of friends in Youth Council who were telling me about it and I just got really interested so I decided to try it out. I decided to participate in Harmony because I thought it would be a good opportunity to give back to the community. I've always been an advocate for uh, giving back to the projects that will better the community and see change and growth in the community. We have a youth philanthropy program that we run uh, across the state where we teach young, young folks how to make grants to youth-led organizations. We worked on raising money to deliver grants to other organizations that were youth-led, so we did a bunch of like fundraisers and a bunch of cool stuff to do that. So you raise the money yourself um, or get it from uh, sponsors, you decide who is um, who you think would best benefit from the money. You have young folks that are engaged in giving back to their community, so, it's, so the, the funds that they raise stays within their community to help some of the uh, uh, young, other young folks in their communities just be better, better citizens. We did a grant last year talking about IOP, which is um, Infinite Park down the street. There was a, um, they were building a greenhouse to grow vegetables to grow for like homeless people. So I thought it was pretty, I was pretty proud to be part of that organization that granted the money so they could do their project. The Green Team at White Oak High School is the organization I'm a part of. I am the president of that organization. And last year when I was just a member and not president, we applied to restore the oak to White Oak and that's when we applied to get trees to plant and beautify our school. And so we did that and it's definitely been, it's given, it's given a whole new meaning to what White Oak is and the trees are symbolic and we've had memorials placed by the trees for students who have passed away and so that's really affected the community. And this year we applied as well and we received uh, some more money and we are having a family farm day where we're learning about um, the different techniques that you can do to have your own sustainable farm so that we can just be healthier overall uh, human beings. Hello everyone, my name is Monica Venegas and I am secretary of White Oak High School's Green Team. And we are teaming up with the FFA and we are going to host a fun to farm day and what this will do is it will teach people the fun and sustainability of farming. I think that Harmony is a wonderful opportunity. I have definitely grown a lot uh, going through the grant making process and applying for grants myself. So it's good to learn early on how to write a grant and to ask for money and the things that you need to do to get involved. Uh, so that if you're applying for scholarships for college and things like that, you know uh, what you have to do to uh, prove that you're deserving of the money that they're giving away. Uh, we would now like to present the, a check for $301 uh, <laughs> to aspire reaching beyond the obvious. My name's Donovan and I'm with the Boys Aspire Group. Uh, a lot of what we do, we talk more a lot about uh, the bullying and uh, just kind of all the troubles that guys can go through during schools and stuff so we can uh, help a lot of the guys out with just any problems they're having and we work on it more and more and do community service type things. And it feels nice to see that a bunch, of, a bunch of youth in our community likes to be selfless and help others and not think about just themselves. but their other youth as well. It gives you a sense of accomplishment and that you had a uh, you had a goal and you wanted to work towards it and then you succeeded at getting that goal. So it just makes you feel um, accomplished and that you have made a change in the community. Every year I walk away with knowing that they've ha they've got a great sense of accomplishment over what they've done. So over the time that we're that we meet uh, through the course of the philanthropy year they know they've made a difference. They know they've created imp an impact. People say there's nothing to do in Jacksonville and we're here right now um, being part of an organization that gives back to your community. Um, I would say that giving money to Harmony is a, it's a great thing to do because you, the people that you are giving money to are the people who will be the future individuals to come and ask for employment at your businesses or to be future uh, customers at your businesses. So these are people who are starting at a young age getting involved in what is happening in their community. Here's an opportunity for businesses to support young folks doing great things. The money stays right here in 
Onslow County. These young folks are making a change in their community. So when you're giving, paying it forward in your own community, every business should want to support that. Every business would, should want to have their name associated with young folks doing positive things. Mm -hmm.